Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Indolis, and welcome back to Sky Factory 2.5. Uh, in the last episode, we managed to get our cobblestone generator going. Uh, and I spent some time off camera uh, working on getting some metals and stuff so that we can automate that. Ooh, seeds. Uh, let's grow more stuff. Um, so we can automate that, and today we are going to automate the cobblestone generation. Uh, and honestly, we're going to start making a little bit more of a, a better base. Um, so this is going to be a scary episode for me, because uh, it's going to require me to destroy a lot of my island. Um, so yeah, the the sifting took a while, but not too long. Uh, I got the five lapis I need, and the eleven redstone, the iron aluminum. I also managed to get two diamonds and an emerald, so that's nice. Um, let's make two more chests, actually, because uh, I want to keep everything, uh, I'm going to want to keep everything in the chest when I, I'm ready to, to destroy my, my entire world. Um, uh, you'll see what I mean here in a little bit, but first things first, let's make the transfer node. So the transfer node isn't too difficult, um, we're going to need to a transfer pipe which is why I have the aluminum uh, we have the two glass and a piece of lapis and then the nuggets will give us transfer pipes uh, we need a block of redstone uh, two redstone uh, chest the the stone and then not iron but the transfer pipe so that'll give us the transfer node items uh, and then in order for that to work we need this world interaction upgrade uh, so all that is is an iron pick um, is it like this I can't remember yeah so the world interaction upgrade uh, now one other thing that I'm gonna want to make five six seven and one of these um, let's just throw this stuff in here so the other thing that I'm gonna want to make is a barrel uh, so barrels are really u really useful for getting a lot of items this does yes it does have every good every mod pack has barrels because it's such a good mod um, so how this works is you just put that on top of there and then this guy on top of that and then you put the world interaction module up in there and it will slowly just start getting <clears throat> getting cobblestone so that will let us I mean I just got 15 in like 20 seconds and then I can start building um, so that is going to be what I want to do today uh, I want to make this area a little bit better uh, in terms of the materials and I don't actually want to use cobblestone as it is so I just wasted all this cobblestone uh, let's Oh, uh, this is what always terrifies me. Let's hop on top of this barrel, and we're going to vein miner the cobblestone. Alright, so I lost a lot of the cobblestone, but no big deal. Hey, we get crops. Um, we have some achievements to um, to hit, so we automated the cobblestone. Um, we, I guess we, we technically have farming space for several crops. Uh, there are several crops here, uh, although I'm going to have a much better... Um, farming area later uh, but one of the next things I want to make is a chisel um, but not a tinker's construct chisel or a carpenter's chisel uh, I want a chisel to chisel is it chisel two in this mod pack whichever so we need an iron ingot and a stick so do I have I don't well, uh, we could make, you know what, let's go ahead and make an, a diamond chisel. Uh, this will last us forever. And we can automate it later. Um, just because I don't have the iron yet. We'll get plenty of diamonds. Um, we already have over a stack of cobblestone. Wow. Wow, three stacks. Alright, we have a ton of cobblestone now. So the whole thing that I want to do is I want to turn this into something that I like the look of. 
And I usually go with this dark panel. Uh, I think I'm going to go with it again. I really do like the look of this cobblestone. And it looks better than the, the standard cobblestone. So this is what we're going to build our base out of. Uh, it's nice and pretty. Alright, so let's get a cobblestone base. Um, I want to hit F7 because I don't want things spawning. Um, that would be bad. So we just kind of do something like this. And yeah, we'll, we'll ring this entire uh, area with the cobblestone. Uh, and what I plan to do is, um, stupid to be honest, uh, I'm going to a vein miner the wooden platform um, because I don't want it. I, I don't want the wooden platform around anymore. Uh, it's time to switch to full blocks of cobblestone. Uh, cobblestone does not. Uh, it has a higher blast resistance. It doesn't catch on. It doesn't catch on fire. We can do so much more with it, uh, and it's it's just in general better. Um, but before we really do anything, I want to. One, get a bunch of leaves, um, because leaves are good, uh, and I also want to kind of clear out everything that I don't need. Uh, so let's break this, let's get the dirt, and I'm going to put most of this stuff in the chest. Um, this also gives me a chance to get more cobblestone. Uh, so let's let's grab the carrots. You know, let's just break all this stuff. We'll do more farming relatively soon. Um, this I know is a hole, so uh, we didn't get it. I was hoping we'd get that, but uh, let's stand on the cobblestone, vein miner the dirt. Alright, so uh, we can pick up this, and I want to put as much of the stuff into the chest as we can, uh, put the seeds in there, carrots, uh, the sticks, everything, everything goes, um, and this time we've gotten five more stacks of cobblestone. So, do I? I don't have an axe, but I do have a mattock. That will work. Breaking most of the stuff. Uh, I am going to want. I don't actually know if I have uh, buckets. I want buckets. Um, so. I can only make buckets out of iron, so I'm going to need more iron. Uh, so before we do too much in the way of uh, destruct destroying everything, uh, I do want to try to get uh, a little bit more iron. And the easiest way to do that, or the best way that's going to be to do that, is uh, if we try to make a new machine. So we need to get Okay, so we need a lot of things. We need power, and we need uh, machinery. Uh, and we can automate cobblestone into dust and all that kind of fun stuff. Uh, but I don't really have the stuff to do that yet. So let's get just a little bit of dust. How many do I need? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Let's do 16 and then I'll sift the rest and hopefully we'll get a little bit of iron. Um, can I vein miner this? Probably. I don't know if vein miner considers that still cobblestone. So let's find out. Uh, it wasn't connected so it doesn't matter. Um, so I need 12 of these to be uh, hammered down into sand. And then from sand, we're going to make it dust. So this episode, we're going to just basically be remaking our base. 
Um, but we're gonna make it nicer and uh, well, overall better. So bunch of clay. I might if I don't get uh, enough iron, I'm just gonna make clay buckets because I want to pick up the water before I destroy this whole little island. Uh, the only things that are going to be left are the chests. Um, so let's sift, see if we can't sift the last few uh, gravels into iron. We'll see what we get. Uh, if we can get just a little bit of iron it would be better, but I think we're going to have to make clay buckets. Um, yeah, so let's pick this up, put it in here. We got, we got the piece of iron, but not enough. So let's break one of these clay blocks and we can grab that, put all of that in there. And I need two clay buckets, which we can smelt up right away. So the next thing is going to be kind of terrifying as well. Uh, we need to break all these torches. And you know what, for the time being, we're going to put torches on the edges. Um, because I don't want things to spawn if I can help it, but if they do, they do. Uh, so once we get the clay buckets, what we're going to do is we're going to pick up the, the water. So we're going to pick up two buckets worth of water, and let's just do that. And now the fun part. We're going to stand on the cobblestone <laughs> because I can break this with my uh, my fist. I'm going to vein miner all of this wooden slab. Yay! Um, so now I can start building. And I'm not going to build constantly every episode. Uh, that is not something I want to do. Um, but we're going to look into some machines today. Uh, now that we have infinite cobblestone, uh, we're going to get our base a little bit better. Um, and once we can get automatic sifting of ores, uh, that's when things are going to get much better. Um, because that means we won't have to continuously uh, sift. Uh, it'll all be automatic and we just get a ton of ores. Uh, so one of the first things we're going to need to do that is uh, power. So the easiest form of power to get I think at this point is a dynamo. Not a dynamo, a uh, survivalist generator. Uh, that is maybe where we're going to start. I don't know yet. Um, but there's some other things that we're going to want to do as well. We're going to want to get mob drops. Uh, that is pretty important. Uh, just because it's going to give us just a bunch of stuff. So one of the first things we're going to want to do is build a mob tower. Uh, and... Oh, out of cobblestone. But luckily, I have automatic cobblestone. I have 15 stacks. So we can take just a bunch of this. Um, we can build forever now. Uh, I want the dark panel. Because I like the way it looks. So let's get like four stacks of these. Uh, there is a machine to automatically chisel blocks as well. Um, but we're not going to worry about that anytime soon. I don't really need all that many blocks and it's not that difficult to chisel it myself, but it is something that we can do later. Um, but the big thing that I'm going to want to do is not only get um, a mob tower, but also get uh, a uh, farm area. So I'm going to want to get some grass and I'm going to want to spawn some, some animals and all that fun stuff. And like I've said before, um, this series, one of the things I'm going to be doing is uh, I'm going to be making like gigantic islands of different biomes. So like right now we're in a plains biome. Uh, if we 
if we built an island, it would be down at like, wow, it would be about this level all the way to void. Um, and it would be a very grassy plains, maybe a couple of trees, but it, I would try to make it look like the normal Minecraft world. So that is the long ter term goal for all of this. Um, let's see what we can get into. Um, so survivalist generator is going to be the first thing we're going to want to make. And it's going to require just a little bit of iron and redstone. So it looks like three of each. Uh, so we'll need to uh, hammer some cobblestone for that. Um, the other thing we're going to want to make is a pulverizer. Um, just a standard one, which is just a bit of iron, some glass, tin, uh, and yeah, that will be fun. Uh, we're gonna want a smeltery relatively soon. Uh, do I have enough tin? I have a little bit of tin. Uh, this is nowhere near enough, so I'm gonna need to hammer out a bunch of materials. But that's that's not a big deal. Um, honestly, early game, that's most of what you do. So there's one tin. Um, don't have any tin powder. So yeah, we're gonna have to do power stuff. But because that's kind of boring, uh, let's hmm see what we can get into here. So Messino farm, we can't do that until we start killing mobs. I don't believe. I I do believe. Um. We need some kind of generator in order to uh, auto pulverize. We could also use the auto hammer. I don't know if that's, yeah, the auto hammer. It's a diamond hammer and a bunch of iron. Uh, that's something we're not gonna be able to do anytime soon. Um, so I'm gonna stick with the pulverizer because pulverizers are a little bit more, um, useful. We also need copper for that, which I have a ton of copper actually. Uh, and we'll need a little bit of gold and redstone as well. So copper is not going to be a problem. Because uh, we need eight copper I think it was. And we have six already. No, not six, uh, four. It's four, not three. Um, we have a little bit of other stuff. Um, so the biggest thing that I think we're gonna have to do is just hammer out some cobblestone, sift it, sift the gravel, and go from there. But let's see if we can't do anything else uh, this episode, because I don't wanna do that on camera. It's kind of boring, uh, so I guess the, the big thing we could look into is, uh, well, let's build, let's see, we could build out this direction and do a little bit of a farm. Um, I really haven't thought too much about how I want this area to look like, um, but I do wanna have a mob tower relatively close. Uh, and for that, we're gonna need a lot of water and We're going to need water, we're going to need, uh, oh, what's it called? We're going to need, like, um, just a long drop. We're going to need something to collect the, the stuff. Uh, so I'm going to want an ender pearl. And the easiest way to get those, so enderman essence, we, we just, we need ender pearls, ender pearl powder. I don't think you can get that from anything. Uh, man infusion, that's way out of our league. Um, uncommon loot would give us ender pearls, so that's a potential way. Um, chance cubes, those are a fun, that's a fun mod that's going to be terrifying to deal with. Uh, and ender lilies is going to be the other way to get ender pearls easily without actually having to ever make a sword. Uh, so the reason I want that is for a. Um, Vacuum hopper, if, oh, uh, it's 
looking for any, anything that's Ender IO. So it's a vacuum hopper. Uh, what is that? Vacuous gas tank. Um, so vacuum hopper is just a hopper, eye of Ender, and a piece of obsidian. So that's going to be what I need for that. Uh, we have so much cobblestone. Oh my gosh. Um, so I guess the thing that we could do, uh, how big is this? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we need to go one more out. That's twenty-one, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1. So I need to make the, the main base about this big um, if I want to make it a nice perfect square, uh, which I do actually. Uh, and then we could also, if I wanted to, I could dump a bucket of water over the edge. You know, let's do this because this is an achievement. Um, I would like to do this when I have flight, but basically I can, oh no, oh no, we're dead, we're dead, we're so dead, um, well I lost my chisel, I lost my water. Oh, well, that was bound to happen eventually. Um, yeah, I misplaced a block, and that caused the, the water currents to, to screw up on me. So I died. Um, what is waypoints? I know that I died. Um, so that's the first death. About time we get that out of the way. Um, so I'm going to need to re-equip, and we lost a lot of food. Uh, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna grow an apple tree because that makes sense to me. Uh, we can always chop it down and get apples later. And if I need food, I can just do that. Um, I'm gonna get my tools back and all that I can. I lost the diamond chisel, which kinda sucks, but we'll get more diamonds later. That's not that big of a deal. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and call the episode there. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of work off camera, uh, cleaning up this area. Um, we, we can technically go down a little bit. Uh, if I break this block, once I get a pick again, uh, I can put a ladder and go down a little bit, uh, or I could take this water and just jump down to that block and ladder back up and make a little platform underneath. Um, I really don't have much of a reason to right now, um, but I realize we lost the achievement book. Um, can I get that back easily? Okay, it's a book and some purple dye. Is that purple? Yeah, purple dye, which... Mm, red isn't too bad to get. So that'll be, so we won't have that book for a while. So, <sighs> all right. I think next episode, what I'm going to work towards is, um, one, I'm going to get a little bit of cobblestone, um, pound it out and get, uh, try to get stuff for the machines. Uh, we lost all that copper and tin. That, that sucks, but we can get it back. But uh, if I can get, uh, so the, the, the main kind of goals is to get survivalist generator, uh, pulverizer, and then I'm also going to want a auto, auto sieve, sieve, which is electrum invar. Ooh. Is there an easy way to make electrum um, pulverized? Okay, so we pulverize some the uh, dust, and it will give us the silver. 
Okay, so I can make the I can make Electrum and Envar pretty easily as long as I can get enough of the the different ores. Um, so we're gonna want to make that as well, and this will let us uh, with power automatically sieve uh, the other way. Sift the the ores. The other way is an autonomous activator, um, which these now take power, but it's a little bit cheaper in terms of what it takes um, but they do take power as well and we need something to catch the stuff so we'll probably just go with the automatic uh, sieve however you say this I can't remember um, but anyways uh, I have a lot of stuff to do to get back to where we were um, this week is gonna be pretty much standard what I was what was last week with uh, what's gonna be on my channel and honestly, next week, I might not be in this world on Monday. Uh, we might play something else. I don't know yet. We'll see. Um, see how I'm feeling and everything. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!